So the principal mission of academic institutions is not only to provide high quality care, but to become a breeding ground for new science to push the boundaries. I am particularly excited about an initiative called the Nimble Initiative. This is a program run by the Foundation NIH, uh, which is a national study uh, working closely with the FDA, academics, and industry in a public-private partnership and in a collaborative research environment to develop simple non-invasive tools to assess liver disease, particularly fatty liver disease, where ultimately when all of this works out, we, it will lead to qualification of these non-invasive tests by the FDA, which will then make these tests available to every doctor all over the U.S. so that in their office, without the patient having to go see another doctor, you can evaluate their liver disease, figure out what's going on, and figure out what to do with them, and I direct them towards appropriate therapy. You know, developing simple non-invasive tests that can be done at the point of care allows the largest number of patients to be evaluated without having to go see other doctors, increase cost of health care, and then identify those who don't have symptoms yet, but who still have enough disease to warrant an intervention. But there's a larger benefit to society because without our patients, without study participants, the science would stop. And so we would then essentially not be able to improve on the things where improvements are needed. So we're deeply grateful to patients, their families, uh, for uh, every minute that they spend with us. I think when you see the impact that the work has on an individual patient, and you can see how it transforms their individual life, I mean, to me, that is very, very powerful. And you know, one thing that has made our research more relevant, and part of the key to my personal academic success has been by putting the patient first and framing these questions in the context of what is most important for the patient.